Championship live on Fight TV. And this is your main event of the evening, a pro fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Introducing first in the red corner, he stands six foot three, weighing 175 pounds. Fighting out of Coburn, Virginia. He is a veteran of 19 fights. Roy Steel Sanders. <laughs> and in the blue corner, he stands 5 foot 11, weighing 175 pounds. Fighting out of Cincinnati, Ohio, he represents Limitless BJJ and Fitness. And he is a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu Black Belt with a record of one win, no losses, Robbie the Hebrew Heartthrob, Mavoft! Everybody, but uh, three men involved, clear in the cage for our main event, getting ready to start momentarily. Be very interesting. I'm done. Like Robbie won his first fight via knockout. It'd be interesting to see if this fight goes to the ground or if he keeps it standing. Touch of gloves. Come on, Robbie. There it is. Good leg kick from Mailoff, straight right from Sanders. Oh, interesting. Oh, 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 kick there, that's, yeah. Robbie controlling the center of the ring, walking him down nice and slow. A little attempt for an oblique kick. Sanders kind of kick. Uh, moving away. Big uh, feeling out process here. Side leg kick from Robbie. Nice leg kick from Robbie Maylove. Taking his time, getting his timing down. Same as Sanders, both these guys kind of feeling each other. There you go, nice. Maylove finding a home for that uh, lead leg. Uh, Come on, there you kick. go. There it goes, Robbie. There you go. Oh, big Robbie takedown from Maylove. Take Ground, oh, what is that? Yeah. Yeah. A slam. Fuck yeah. Finish it. Robbie Mayloff. Big takedown and then a big belly slam. He's in the guard here, Sanders. And this is where Robbie Mayloff is on, just Robbie. dangerous. He's just dangerous on the ground. Absolutely. I mean, once he's connected to you and you're on the floor, it's, it's going to be trouble. Oh. Uh, Murray yeah. Sanders just made a big on, mistake. He uh, definitely needs to try to turn back into his opponent. It looks like uh, he's here. Yeah. You know, there you see Robbie doing something he's not able to do in all of the jiu-jitsu tournaments that he competes in so regularly. Loosen up the pickle jar yeah. strikes. <laughs> right, on, right. Put that in there. I wonder how hard it is to remember that, oh, yeah, I can. I can knee this guy. I can, I can elbow him in the face. Right. There he is. Oh, oh wow. wow. North South wow. Joe. Lace that up and finish the job quickly. Just so effortless. 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 <laughs> yes. Effortless. I can't even say it. That was very impressive. Wow, uh, very impressive. Yeah, Here we he, go. We see Very nice transition. See how he kind of moves counterclockwise. Hook that. He hooks that neck. Transition. Robbie sets him up so eloquently. Right there. There, right there. That's you good. see it. Connects There's the choking hands. as he moves counterclockwise. A little more pressure is applied every time until we get our win. Once again, I'm going to go in and talk to our winner. 
Uh, don't forget to uh, check Premier MMA Championship.com right, for future events, and I'm going to let seconds. Jerry the match into round round number one. one. It's been an honor. Referee George Connolly stops his fight, and he sees the tap out to the north-south choke. Your winner, Robbie the Hebrew Heart Crab. Mayloft. Winner by strangulation, Robbie Mayloff. Very impressive. Uh, Keeping his unblemished for a record attack. Here's All right, I'm here with your winner, the Hebrew heartthrob, Robbie Maylock. Robbie, your second time in the cage as a professional in MMA. A beautiful north south choke. Give me your thoughts on the fight. Well, um, I, I feel good. I mean, what can I say? I feel pretty damn good. I uh, did a really good job staying focused the last you know, couple weeks. This fight came 11 days notice. I really appreciate Roy stepping up. I mean, a round of applause to Roy for coming in here. Every man and woman who steps in this cage, you gotta applaud them because we're putting our butts on the line. And uh, no, the fight went how I thought it would. I took my time, tried to stay patient, pick my shots. I wish it would have landed more with my punches, but Roy's a long fighter, and so I took the opportunities I got, and when I secured the choke, it's a wrap. Robbie, if you don't mind me saying, so you have, have competed so over the years in, in so many different things, you, you've been so successful, but making the transition to a professional MMA fighter, you took your time to do that, and now that you did your debut not so long ago, you're wasting no time getting back in here. So I'm curious, do you have the plan for what's next? What, what's the plans for Robbie Mello? Yeah, I mean, time's of the essence, right? I'm 28, I'm not getting any younger. I had my first MMA fight 10 years ago. I'm like the old young guy in the sport, and my time will pass me before I know it, so I, I'm not done yet. I got more fights left in me. I don't know how many more, but I still got some fight left in me, and I hopefully can do it in front of my friends, my family, my students. I love this sport. It's given me everything in my life. I'm just blessed to be here. Nothing but respect for you, my friend. Congratulations. Very imp impressive. You got the sign, you got the people there. Congratulations. Thank you, Turtle. Last thing I want to say is uh, thank you to all my friends, my mom here in the cage, my students, of course, Limitless Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and Fitness, Best Martial Arts Gym in Cincinnati, and uh, I love you guys. You guys are my family. You're my everything. And uh, after party at Igby's in Cincinnati. Let's go. I don't have to say this, but you guys give it up for Robbie Mayloff.